Hello everyone, welcome back again to On Hot Channel. My name is Anas, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to change the color of the text on the footer of your Shopify store. So in my previous video, I did show you how to set a background image to the footer of your Shopify store. And I did mention if the picture that you want to set as the background for the footer, it might be a lighter color, then it will not be clearly visible for the customers. Because obviously is the background color is the same as the text color or closer. So it will not be clearly visible. And currently on Shopify team customizer, you cannot change the color of the text to only on one section. You either change it on the whole Shopify store or the whole page or you cannot change it. So in order to fix this issue or in order to set the color different than the background picture that you want to set to the footer, you need to change the text only on the footer, not the whole Shopify store, only on the footer. And as I said, currently Shopify does not give you the option. But if you are watching on how channel and I will give you the option. So in this video, I will show you how to change the text color on the footer of your Shopify store and I mean only the footer. The other sections or the whole Shopify store will obviously have a different color that you did set on the team customizer. And if you are wondering how the background picture looks like on the footer, here it is, let me show you that. Actually, this is the Shopify store that I do all the tutorials on. And as you can see this video banner right here, as well as the transparent uh, header and a lot more. I did show all the things in here in videos in tutorials and I did provide the call and I did provide every information for you just to make your Shopify store unique and branded. So if you are interested in how to do so, make sure to check out my channel. As I said, I've made a lot of videos, but let's just scroll down and check out the footer. And here it is. As you can see, this is the, uh, the background picture that I did set to the footer. And if you notice, the text does not look really good, as you can see, because the background picture or the color for this section right here, which is the sand, is really similar to the text, which is black. So I need to change the color for the text only on the footer. On the other sections in here, I need to keep them just like this. And as you can see, I did set a, a different section, a background picture, and that's completely different trick and it's not, not the same as the footer. It does require a custom CSS code in order to do this. So without any more talking, let's just get to it and show you how to change the color of the text on your Shopify footer. And I mean only on the footer. So the first thing you're going to do is obviously access the Shopify dashboard, right? Then the next thing you're going to do is click on online store on the left menu, then click on the three dots on the left of customize right here. It will show you this menu and click on edit code and it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. Then the next thing you're going to do is find a file called team.liquid and you might find it at the top of the uh, options right here. As you can see, it's the second one, team.liquid. If you cannot find it, then use the search bar right here, click on it and type in team.liquid or just team and it will show you the file, which is this one right here. In my case, here it is, I'm gonna click on it and it will show me a lot of calls in the team that liquid. And this is the Ruby Rails uh, programming language, which is the language they use for the Shopify scripts and so on. And the next thing you're going to do is scroll all the way down to the bottom page and you will see uh, slash forward slash body. As you can see, if you cannot find it, simply use the search metrics or the search future by simply click on control F if you are Windows or if you are Mac like me, click on command F and it will show you this prompt right here at the bottom of the page and type in forward slash body and it will highlight it on the code for you. But in my case here is I already find it and you will actually find it at the bottom of the screen. I'm just saying this in the future, the section might be changed or something like that. So you can find it by using this trick. So let's just close this. Then the next thing you're going to do is scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code. Simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a very short code. As you can see, it's five lines to be exact. So simply select the call and make sure you do select the whole code in here, then right click and copy. After that, get back to the code editor right here. And as I said, make sure to find forward slash body because we need to pass in this code above forward slash body, not below, but above, not after, but above and before forward slash body in here in this section, as you can see. So after that, simply paste in the code before forward slash body. And you might notice in here, as you can see, the color is a hex color. Uh, so let's just copy this or actually just get back access Google search engine. Then type in uh, color picker right here and it will show you this widget. Here it is. 
and you can select the code that uh, you want or the color actually let's just go for something blue or actually let's just keep it as red let's just go for brighter red or more stronger red after that simply copy the code by clicking on this button right here which is the hex color and get back in here and simply replace this hex color with the new code that you want to set for the background so let's just paste it in here and here it is after that let's just click on save so the changes will be saved then we will get back to the Shopify store and check out the footer and reload in the page and the color should be changed to this color right here which is red and that will be really obvious and red is really bad color for the text this is just for demonstration so you can see it's actually working so let's just get back to the Shopify store here Riz. then as you can see the text does not look really clearly so I would reload the page and it will become red so let's just reload the page and scroll down and here it is as you can see the text become red and it's really obvious right now and as I said red is really a bad choice for a color for the text because it does not really look good in this case make sure to pick the best color that suits the background which is most importantly to suits the background that you want to set for the Shopify footer even if you do not set the background for the you might need to change the color for the text or you want to change the color for the text to make it more unique here you go for you so that's how you change the text color on Shopify footer I mean any store any Shopify team and as I said if you have any questions or any video requests make sure to drop on below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me I don't reply to each comment if you are wondering again why is that because simply I'm working for you otherwise I take my job but it's done for this video so thanks for watching catch you in the next one